Hi, my name's John Peterson. Uh, you may be familiar with some of the work that we do, uh, the Best Practice Program, which is a unique program Australia-wide for accountants to achieve uh, growth, succession and work-life balance. This uh, particular video, I want to talk about the cloud and what to do first and why. The cloud is the hottest opportunity, the hottest topic uh, in the accounting profession worldwide today. It's even hotter than succession planning. It probably shouldn't be hotter than succession planning. We'll come back to that topic later. But the reason it's so hot is because there is so much change going on in the cloud. It's not just any one element. There's your front office, the way you sell, the way you market, the way you communicate. There is your middle office, the way you drive your engine room. There's your back office, the way you process, the way you get uh, back office work done. All of these things are automated, automated opportunities now. And you know, there was not so much automating going on uh, 10 years ago, there was very little. So the cloud is changing the way you do business in the accounting profession. Interestingly, why you should get started in the cloud? Pretty simply, if you haven't already, most accounting firms that implement any one cloud initiative in terms of a new product or service to their clients are typically experiencing better than 15% growth per annum compounding. Because what's happening is that implementation, even if it's only one product, it's actually leading to an evolution in the culture of the accounting practice and its employees. So as you embrace one service, one vertical revenue stream as a new initiative, by just learning that one skill, as Jim Rowan would say, if you learn just one more skill, it can often lead to you doubling your profits. So it's an amazing thing if you could add one more product or revenue stream to your practice, you can double your profits. The next reason is that the market out there, all of your customers existing and not yet found, your prospects, they are also looking at the cloud. So they're wondering what are you going to do about the cloud. And if you're not going to do anything about the cloud, that leaves you very vulnerable. So just having one proposition is going to be great for retaining your clients. It's also going to be great for, uh, from a website point of view, from a promotional point of view, to have out there so prospects that are looking for a new accountant, if they recognize one thing that you're doing, that creates a perception that you're a cloud accounting firm. So that means you're not going to miss out on new business when the new business is out there looking. And less than 50% of the profession has embraced the cloud, much less than that. So that means you're you know, ahead of the game. And finally, most importantly, where would you start I would personally recommend you start with a product or a service that already has recognition in the marketplace. You can look at a product like Xero, for example, and you might be thinking, oh, is, I don't know, I, you know, you might be an MYOB person, for example, or a QuickBooks person, or have some other affinity that's holding you back from looking at a product like Xero. But the reality is, Nearly a million SMEs worldwide, maybe more now, have actually moved to zero in just three years. So that groundswell of interest, I was talking to a, 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 an accountant today uh, on a video conference and they're over in Perth and they said that even though they have been reluctant to look at zero, their own clients are finding out about it and the accountant said to me, I don't know what it is about their marketing. I said, no, it's not their marketing, it's going viral. So if a product or a cloud service is going viral, you really need to be aware of that. Now, finally, we've got probably the most important free cloud webinar on how to grow your business through the cloud and what to do and when to do it and why. It's coming up and it'll be on the screen again in just a moment. So. This is an event that you cannot miss this year. So book in, it's free, it's only gonna run for about an hour and 10 minutes, and I've got some of Australia's most successful young dynamic accounting firms on the video. They're gonna attend my office here in my studio, and you're gonna hear from them firsthand. One of them is Philip Ethemu. He's using the iFirm, which is a CCH product, and he is using it comprehensively. He's achieving 20% growth compounding. He's a very successful person. He's got a, a, an award in the Best Practice Program. He's a national award winner. And Jamie Johns, who's probably the highest profile, uh, originally sole practitioner right now in Australia, Jamie Johns is a cl uh, cloud accounting firm finalist of the year with Zero. He was a keynote speaker at ZeroCon in 2013 in Sydney. He's won a national award with the Best Practice Program, with my program. Uh, he is uh, gaining something like two new leads a week. Two new leads a week on Zero. So make sure you book into, not Zero, I beg your pardon, through cloud-based opportunities. So make sure you book into our webinar. 
That's all for this week. We'll see you again soon.